um, have been doing some research, professor, in polymers for solar cells. Tell us a little bit about um, your recent breakthrough. Okay, thank you. First, thank you for coming. And then, uh, uh, so we have been working on the things called uh, organic or polymer solar cell for the past 10 years. So the difference compared to the polymer to uh, other uh, uh, inorganic like silicon solar cell is that is, is, is easy to process. So I can show you one example. So this is one example that we have a star company uh, not far away from here called Solomon. So this is in their machine they coat the films in a, in a, in a, in a row to row coating process. So this solar cell has not put down electro yet. It's just the material is laid down on the top. So that's how the future solar cell from plastic will look like. And then, uh, uh, so it's, it's a roll, you can think about it's a roll, roll coating machine, roll to roll right. coating machine, and the, the solar cell just continuous coat. And the raw material actually is not too much different uh, looks compared to the, the chemical polymer in this, in this jar. So what we do is dissolve this polymer into a solvent, so it's a liquid. It's a liquid right. semiconductor. Compared to silicon, it's, it's a wafer. So we can, once it's a liquid, you are able to coat different ways, like a spray coating or other coat. In, in the case of the star company, they do the so-called row to row coating process. So a recent breakthrough is that uh, we know the solar sun, the, the energy from the sun is very broad spectral. It covers all the way from infrared to visible, which we see things, and the to UV. The difference, the difficulty of this material is only a soft, a narrow window of the solar spectrum. So our recent breakthrough is, can we actually put two materials or three materials to cover the whole spectrum? Okay. So, so basically we call tendon solar cell. So just like a double-decker bus. You think one, decker, one, one layer of the bus, you can carry certain number of passengers. You, you add another layer, you can double the capacity. So that's the basic principle of of taking two different materials and then layer them, stacking them two layers, so we can cover broad, broader coverage. Oh.